Right, okay, so this is just to help with question six in the booklet that you've got, because it's probably going to be the last booklet um, you have. Everything else is going to move to slides. Um, but it's just to address something that I've seen once I've been looking at Hassan's work, okay? So it says at noon, ferry F is 400 metres due north. So 400J, okay? Um, of an observation point R and is moving with a constant velocity. Now, if we see constant velocity, we know that we can use R equals VT. Sorry, that's just out of shot. R equals VT. We don't need to use a SUVAT because there's no acceleration and we don't need to integrate our differentiate. Okay. Um, and then it said a speedboat, speedboat S is 500 meters due east. So that's 500i moving with a constant velocity of minus 3i plus 15j. Now what I want to go over here is the collision part in part B, but just to show you where I'm starting from to part B, I need to go over part A. Um, so part A, um, if we use r equals vt on both of these, or ut, um, so we've got that the velocity of the ferry is 7i plus 7j. Okay, we want it at t seconds, so t is equal to t. So if I wanted to find out how far it travelled, I'd multiply 7i plus 7j by t. And now if I want to know its position, I need to add on its original position. So I've got 400j plus t times 7i plus 7j. So 400j plus 70i plus 70j. Okay, um, which what I've done then, if you look, is I've collected all the i terms, which is just 70i, and I've collected all the j terms together, 70 plus 400j. If I do the same for the speedboat, so the speedboat started at 500 metres due east, um, it had a constant velocity of minus 3i plus 15j, and again it's t seconds. Okay, so it's um, velocity times time, which would give us minus 3ti plus 15tj. That should be minus 3ti, sorry, plus 15tj, just realised. Okay, and then I add on my initial position, which is 500i. So again, if I collect the like terms together in the i direction, I've got 500 minus 3ti. And in the j direction, I've got 15tj. Okay, so they're for the ferry and the speedboat. Now on part B, it says show that F and S will collide and find the position vector of the point of collision. Okay, so if they collide, it basically means they are in the, at the exact same place or position, I should say, at the same time. Okay, which means that the i and j component of the position vector at a particular time will be exactly the same for the ferry and the speedboat. So here you can do one of two things. You can either equate the i's or you can equate the j's. And if I show you, you get the same answer for here. So because they're going to be in exactly the same position, I know that 70 has got to be equal to 500 minus 3t. So that's if I was to look at the i's. If I was to look at the j's, in a, using exactly the same, I'd have 70 plus 400 would have to be equal to 15t. So I've, for this one, if I look at the i's, I can do it's one or the other, you don't need to do both. I've got 70 equal to 500 minus 3t, or I've got 70 plus 400 equal to 15t. And if you look, if I solve each one of these, I get that t is 50. Okay, so that means now that they will meet, they will be at the same point when t is equal to 50. Okay, if I want to find the position vector now at the point of collision, all I need to do is substitute that t equals 50 into these expressions and prove that they're at the same point, okay? And if they're at the same point at the same time, they've got to collide. So if I've got R equals 70i plus 70 plus 400j for my ferry, okay? Using t equals 50 now. So I'll just move that up a little bit. 
um, that gives me 350i plus So 7 times 50 is 350 plus 400, 750j. So that's where the speedboat is, okay, when t equals 50, all right? Oh, sorry, that's where the ferry is. If I now look at the speedboat when t equals 50, I've got that r equals 500 minus 3ti plus 15tj, okay? So 500 minus 3 times 50, 500 minus 150 is 350i, 15 times 50 is 750j, okay? So <clears throat> therefore, they're at the same position. At the same time, so they collide at 350i plus 750j meters okay so they collide 350 meters east 750 north of that observation point above all right any questions please let me know okay thank you